This is a video about using Microsoft Excel 2010 uh, to create a shared uh, construction punch list. Uh, this is part one. It's about creating and formatting a spreadsheet table. Uh, fairly straightforward, and uh, but just the first step. This is the spreadsheet. Uh, it's already been set up. Uh, nothing uh, very complicated about this. There are, however, a few features. And I want to go over this uh, spreadsheet. will be available for uh, free download. So um, in terms of column sizes and everything like that. Uh, a few items. Um, these are uh, right justified. These titles. These uh, data blocks for project name, owner, and architect. And these cells are merged and centered. And this item uh, right here, the punch list items, that title is centered in these merged cells. And it's something new in 2010. And that's these vertical alignment cells right here. So you can see that. And uh, we're down there or up top, but we're choosing that center alignment in these uh, merged cells vertically. Also, over in this area right here, just to stand out a little bit, we used uh, white uh, text. Put that right here. And of course, until you fill that cell with some color, the white text doesn't show up and it looks like you don't have any text there at all. We have a few uh, narrow rows. One right here, very small one, just do some separation between these columns. Uh, it's kind of important a little bit later on. We do some other formatting. There's also a very narrow column right here, and it's basically for some stuff in this column so that it doesn't run over into the uh, next one when there's nothing in here. Uh, we have um, a particular number format that's been used over in this column. Of course, these numbers are all put in there using the fill handle. But to take a look at that. We'll uh, look at the number format, and this is a uh, custom format, and basically for the format here we're putting in 0, 0, 0, and that's what gives us the, the three uh, number places. Also, we have uh, in this grid where we're putting the punch list items, a uh, format that's used for this whole thing for the uh, borders and put that up here in terms of the border and uh, the part we're looking at right there we have a solid line on the edges and then we're using this uh, dotted line right here for everything in between so a solid that goes all the way around the outside we're just looking at one corner of that right now we're using uh, both this uh, column, all the cells in here, as well as in this column, are all set to uh, word wrap. You can see that right here. So that's basically the uh, only thing that really um, is all different with this spreadsheet. In the next part, we'll be uh, looking at doing some uh, data filtering. Further information. Let's see, uh, Dr. Infrastructure dot com.